How's it going? We're here on H1. Incredible name, I know. It's basically modded Modern Warfare Remastered. You can think of it as, a, as like Plutonium slash IW4X, but it's Modern Warfare Remastered. It's it's incredible, honestly. It's only been out for like, what, what like 10 days? I don't know, I gotta double check, but it's, it, it hasn't been a long time since this came out. This is the most fun I've had in like a while. On Call of Duty. I could keep I keep going negative, but like I don't feel like destroying everything in my path just because I go negative. That's rare. I don't know why I immediately went for sniper. I played like SMG all day. But this is it. I've like played it for a while. I feel like all the issues just kind of just went away by themselves. But some servers have like weird micro stutters where it would just like jitter, but not really. Like it wouldn't be like an FPS jitter, but like the server would kind of just like start and stop, which is more like common than you think. The more I think about it, the more I realize I don't know if I have actually recorded a Modern Warfare Remastered video on the channel. Like I just I just try to think of like a video. Oh shit. I try to think of what whether or not I have recorded one, but I don't think I have. Like I genuinely don't think I've ever had a Modern Warfare Remastered video on the channel, which is weird because I played the hell out of it on, on the Xbox for like a little while. Oh my god, can you stop honking, please? Hey, here's the MP5, by the way. I forgot it had this little recoil. I always thought it was w way worse. So this is like a... Okay, this is a pleasant surprise, though. You also go insanely fast using this thing. It's just... It's so fun. It's so smooth when you don't have micro stutters and just like lagging for no reason it does do that sometimes usually when there's like kill streaks on screen it doesn't like ease into lagging when there's like a ton of kill streaks on screen it literally just like almost like flip oh my god is someone's car alarm going off what the hell is that it's like a it's like a switch flips like it just turns from not lagging to lagging i don't know why it does that but uh, i mean i know why it does that obviously a lot of stuff in the air but like usually it's not that sudden that just starts lagging. You can deal with it just fine, but it's just kind of annoying. Also, yes, if you do choose to compel shaders on an RTX graphics card, your game will crash, but it's like kind of like a weird crash. It doesn't like automatically close the game and pop up with like an air screen window or anything like that. Like it literally just turns the game black completely. And then on, on like the little like command thing, like the little, like the, you know which one. If you open that up, it will say like error number one graphics problem or whatever. What? I'm not using this. Give me... Fang. Yeah, if you thought this was COD 4 for a second, uh, it's not. I still don't know what weapon this is based off of, but the, the iron sight reminds me heavily of, like, Advanced Warfare. I'm so good at this. Also, the TDM games go for, like, forever. Like, the score limit is, like, 420 or some bullshit. I'm not saying that as, like, a meme. Haha, <laughs> 420, like, actually is the score limit in, like, 9% of servers. Which is kind of annoying. I do wish the games could be shorter, but oh well. Also, I think the game is so new that they just haven't made any, ma like, map voting plugins yet. It's like, you sure just can't vote for maps on, like, any server. You will always just have to just play whatever the server decides. Which also kind of sucks. Because then that means I have to play Overgrown. That map is shit. Holy shit, what is this kill streak? How much do you need for a helicopter? Is it five or seven? I don't remember. I think it was seven. Five doesn't really make much sense. That's like so little. Oh, no, it is five. Oh, that's for the airstrike. Forgot there was three kill streaks. Fuck. Okay, well then. Is that good? That might be a bad spot. Oh, no, that's working. You're chilling right now. You know it is. I did actually see a populated SND server on here, which is kind of crazy. I'm probably going to try that right after this. What the hell was that guy trying to do? I also you can like swap to your melee weapon on here, which is kind of weird. That's not in COD 4. Nice. What the f- My aim is trash. I don't want to try, dude. I'm just going to crawl away. Uh, give me the AK. Also, I'm be, I'm be real. I don't like the AK sound in MWR. It just doesn't. It's just not right. Same thing with the attack aggressor. I feel like every time they try to redesign the intervention sound, it just sounds worse. Now I know that's probably to, like make it more realistic to the actual guns. Like MW2, you know, that's like 2009 primitive technology. You know how it is. But like, it sounds so much worse in real life. <laughs> give us the gaming sounds, dude. I don't know. I know that they're adding the intervention tomorrow for two. That's like. 100% leak nowadays, but they better bring back the original sound or at least like a variation of it Don't make like a new thing. Oh, the game's about to end. I guess we're gonna move on to SND. I haven't actually tried SND yet Uh, that's gonna be interesting What the 
that's normal oh i like this map too bad i want to play search let me in also this is apparently like based off of like the s1x code or whatever which is like the advanced warfare mod do we respawn next round oh did we just got like completely annihilated they have like six people still alive on their team okay that guy's cracked oh shit wait my team is entirely bots you gotta be kidding me dude there are no real players in search it's all bots there another server i don't want to play against bots dude i don't these servers are empty yeah okay there is no search i got just completely baited. I'm in a private match really quick. I want to show you guys the ultimate way to get good at sniping. I'm serious. Set the shipment team deathmatch. Other options. Time limit. Set this to unlimited. Score limit. Unlimited. This also goes for just like getting better at centering as a whole. Rematch time just doesn't matter. None of this matters actually. Although I would disable kill cam just to make things a little quicker. And then no kill streaks. No respawn delay. None of that. Leave this as is. And I just save that. And now zero bots on your team and then six on the other and the recruit bots. I think some people already know where I'm going with this. Now I just make an M40 class. Sidearm just make this whatever. Perks also don't really matter but I recommend stopping power. Actually no I, I don't even, you generally just it doesn't matter. Say the melee. All you're really good at focus on is the sniper anyway. And I just start the game. Auto assign. Choose a sniper class and then that's it you can have like a ton of bots spawning and this is it this is how you practice quick 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 scoping what the f uh, this really do does feel just like at my grandma's house yeah you also can't ban specific perks so you're kind of just so if, if a bot has jug you're just gonna have to deal with it but yeah i i am real i had no other ideas <laughs> So I just wanted to show this, I guess, because it's like the only other real thing I know about MWR. I'm gonna hop out of this one here. But yeah, that's H1. It literally just came out. Check it out. It's dope. Only issue is that's like 80 gigabytes. It takes up a lot of space. So you're gonna have to be okay with that at first. And then if you are, then yeah, just install it. You're good.